In this video series, we will complete a Revit project in 12 easy steps. Please subscribe to our channel for future updates. We have created doors and windows in our previous video. Now let's see how we can add doors and windows tags in Revit. Let's go to Annotation Ribbon. Now click on the Tag All button. Here we will select window tags from the category. And then press the OK button. We can see that Revit has automatically applied tag to all our windows. We can see our small windows have a W1 mark and our big windows have a W2 mark. Now let's repeat the process for door tags. We will click on the tag all button and select door tags from the category. Our door tags have been applied. We can see that Revit is showing a door mark here. If we select the door and go to properties, we can see the mark parameter is set to 1. If we click on edit type, we can see that the type mark is D1. To view the type mark on the plan, we will select our door tag family and click on edit family at modify door tag ribbon. Once we click on it, we see that Revit has changed its environment. We are now in family editor mode. Now select 101 and click on the edit label button. Here we will select the type mark in our list and we will remove the mark from the list. Now the label has changed to T1. We can also change the shape of our door tag. Now click on load into project and close button. I will not save the changes. Now click on the overwrite the existing version. Now we can see that door tags have changed. They are now showing their type marks. Now door and window tags are correctly placed. In the next video we will create a floor. What do you think about the video? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoy this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.